welcome back to Marie's Kitchen. Before we start this mukbang, I just want to show you guys how I make my quick and simple vegan cornbread. So these are the ingredients you're gonna need. If you guys wanna see how to make it, just keep on watching. All right guys, so first we're gonna start with a cup of flour. One cup of flour. Gonna need a cup and one fourth cup of cornmeal. Next, you're gonna need a half a cup of sugar. You're gonna need a half a teaspoon of salt. You're gonna need one tablespoon of baking powder. So this is our dry ingredients. We're just gonna mix everything together. You're gonna need a cup of non-dairy. I'm using unsweetened almond milk. I need five tablespoons of melted vegan butter. So we're using one pack of applesauce. This is my egg replacement. And I'm using unsweetened applesauce. I'm gonna be taking some vanilla extract and I'm using about a teaspoon of that. So now that you have all your ingredients in, you're just gonna mix everything together. You're gonna go ahead and preheat your oven for 400 degrees and lightly grease your pan. Now I'm gonna go ahead and pour the mixture. Alright guys, so this is how it should look. We're gonna go ahead and throw it in the oven for about 20 to 25 minutes. Alright guys, so this is a cornbread out of the oven after 20 minutes and this is how it looks. So we're gonna go ahead and cut it up and get ready for the mukbang. Liddy gang, Liddy gang gang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so fresh, yeah. Fresh, fresh. fresh. <laughs> What's the deal fam? Welcome back to our channel. If you guys are new to this channel, what's the deal? My name is HD. My wifey Marie right here. We got my son Darion and Alana. And today you guys, if you guys can see, we got that vegan barbecue yes. on the menu today. <laughs> popping. Yes you guys. We was craving barbecue. We really uh, wanted some barbecue. So we got some barbecue baked beans, greens, homemade cornbread and here's our delicious vegan barbecue meats and we got our plates made already we're about to say grace and dig in dear heavenly father lord forgive us for our sins thank you for this food you bless us with bless the hands of the prepared lord in your precious name we pray amen amen amen, amen. I, I need a good mm. burger I'm ready. Mm. you want a burger mm. get your burger oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> y'all saw that um what was that on a Love smash. smash. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. That was years ago. Mm. 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 We ain't got much, you guys. It was the Lincoln or the hamburger and the hot dogs. Mm -hmm. Gotta make it work. Oh my gosh, this cornbread's the bomb. Y'all already know. I know y'all like to get all this, huh? But, um, Can you pass mm -hmm. me a burger? Yeah, that one. This one? Mm hmm. Uh, Cheers, Excuse me, mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you. Can you pass me one of my mm -hmm. um, links? Links? Yeah. Ooh, hot links are hot for me. Ooh, we're smoking. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. All right, man, let me try something for this time. Y'all, look at that. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, the burger looks inside. I need some more. You don't want no pickles on your burger right there? Mm. No, you're fine? 
Mm, I forgot about Oh these. my god, you guys. These are the Bobby. apple sage. And Bay put them on a barbecue grill. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Try it and thank me later. <laughs> so good. We're going mm. straight for the greens first. Man, mm. this is so good. Is it hot? No, you know the apple sage one is not spicy. Your dad made some spicy ones. Mm. I like the spicy mm. ones, but like, it'd be spicy. I'd be like, whew. <laughs> This is so but good. Yeah. I like more. No, but these mm -hmm. greens are so good, you guys. You guys want to um make these greens? I'm gonna put the recipe right here on the screen for you guys. Mm -hmm. you must try it. Bomb down. Let me give them a close up. Mm. Mm -hmm. Put your burger on there. If you guys, you guys want it with the white? I mean, it's cheese. I showed you guys in the beginning. Mm-hmm. Whoa! <laughs> the um, the what chow you, cheese. We're gonna do it like that. I like it flipped over. Uh, you funny. Perfect. Mmm. Mmm. Mm, so good, man. Love barbecue. Mmm. 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 Right. All right, you guys. See all that HD special for y'all. HB, not even HB. It's HD. It's the HD special though. Mmm. Got potato salad right there. Babe, put her foot in that. I already know. I ain't gonna try that. Sausage. Mmm. Mm, those beans though. And that burger, cornbread. Oh, y'all see? Y'all like that recipe on that cornbread? Mmm. Got that corn beef. Uh, the corn beef. <laughs> <laughs> Got that cornbread recipe. I gotta tell you guys. Last time. We was going on the last video. We was making the um, the cornbread recipe. Babe forgot the main ingredient or one of them, some milk. It's like, come on, man. You guys, it came out so crazy. I was like, nah. Mm -hmm. I didn't forget it. For we didn't have any, and I thought we had some here. Yeah, that's what I mean. You forgot at the store. Oh, I thought you meant I forgot to add it. Oh no. Mm. Mm, let me get mm. some of these beans. I don't even know mm. what to eat, you guys. This is so good. Mm, look at baby, um, baked beans. Beans, greens, tomatoes, potatoes. Look at you guys. Dang. Let's drop it. <laughs> you guys, it's really simple. Mm. Well, let us know if you guys want to see this recipe. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm. But how's y'all day going? Hope you guys' day going good. Hope you guys' weekend was great. You know what I mean? Thank you. Mm. Teachers are finally off strike. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> Teachers are finally mm. off strike. I'm so happy about that. It's time for these kids to get their self up and up out of here. Mm hmm. Mm. Y'all know how the kids get when they ain't got no school or they stay at home, you know, they okay, definitely, you hmm? Okay, yeah, yeah, you still No, not that. They eat up all the food in the refrigerator. Oh, yeah, that too. All right, get up out of here, y'all. <laughs> that too, definitely. Mmm. Mmm. I can barely talk. <laughs> this food is so good. So good. Oh, my goodness. Mm 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 yeah, you guys, so today, we wanted to, I need to slow down a little bit. <laughs> today, we wanted to talk to you guys about a couple, a couple of different topics. One of them, I kind of briefly wanted to talk about our name, because we got a lot of comments um, about how we got our name and uh, why we chose that name. So, I kind of just wanted to kind of briefly touch on that. 
Our name, Ghetto Vegans, we chose that name because we feel like people perceive ghetto in a negative way or they look at it as something like something low. And for us, the ghetto is where we come from. The ghetto is something that shaped us into people that we are today. So we're proud to be from there and to be of something that shaped us the way we are. So when we hear ghetto, we don't look at it as a bad thing. It's not, ghetto to us is not anything negative. So we wanted to bring light and shed light on the ghetto in a positive way instead of making it um, look in a degrading or negative light. And not even that, but as being vegans, to I mean ghetto people as <laughs> vegan, man. For real. Yeah. yeah. And, oh, you want to hold it? Yeah, and another thing, to be honest, you don't see a lot of people of color that are vegan. That's, you that's from, know? Like, from the ghetto ghetto. Yeah, ghetto. that's from the ghetto. So, the, some of the comments, you know, you like... Spicy? No, no, no. You want spicy or regular? Spicy. She wants spicy. You want spicy ones? I think it's a little bit too hot for me. It is? Hot to spicy also. Spicy is always hot. Yeah, you guys. So, we just wanted to address that really quick. Oh, excuse me. That's why we chose a name. We love where we come from. We appreciate what where we come from and what it taught us. So we only thought the name would be perfect. That's why we love the name for ourselves. And that's why we chose mm. the name of our channel, Ghetto Vegan. To show ghetto doesn't always have to be a negative thing. Mm-hmm. And we're vegans. Yep. <laughs> you said, and we're vegans. So that's why we chose that name for everybody who was wondering. Mm-hmm. Mm, I think mm, I want mm. another hot one. Ew. Yeah. It's too barbecue. Cause it's riddle time! Hey! You got me that one. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Let's see what's up on the grill today. <laughs> oh, she's right here. Right? right. Alrighty. She's trying to have a barbecue joke. Cause we <laughs> I have hundreds of legs, but I can only lean. You make me feel dirty so you can feel clean. What am I? And wait, wait. You guys got... You guys have 30 seconds again. Yeah, you should, wait, read it one more time. Alright. I have hundreds of legs, but I can only lean. You make me feel dirty so you can feel clean. What am I? Timer starting now. Hundreds of legs? Excuse me. Babe, what do you think that is? It can only lean. You make me feel dirty for so you can feel clean. A broom? Ding, ding, ding! At 16 seconds! Mark oh Dairy! Oh my God, Dairy! Yes! Give it up for Dairy! Yeah, you got it! Second time! I'm, I was really stuck. Damn. Dang, how did Derry get that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, let's see. What's the second one? How many breaks does it take to complete a 2,000 square foot building made entirely of brick? Timer starting right now. How many breaks does it take to complete a 2,000 square foot building made entirely of brick? What? <laughs> <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? Is it? what? Oh my god. <laughs> mm. Okay. You guys have 23 seconds. Come on now. Mia, yeah, oh. you don't get up out here. And my other dog right here. Um, Alrighty. Stop. Alright, so. Oh, you guys didn't even get to call me for the first one. <laughs> You forgot she getting a little rusty. No, Derry. Re oh Derry yeah, Derry got, got it quick. All right, how many bricks does it take to complete a two thousand square foot building made entirely of brick? So you guys have five mm. seconds to answer. Five or pause the video. Five, four, three, two, one. So, how many bricks does it take to complete a two thousand square foot building made entirely of brick? Only one. The last brick completes the building. How many bricks does it take to complete a 2,000 square foot building? <laughs> you are so uh, I was waiting for that, so I'm like, let me hear Woo! Got that one. Mm. You funny. I know you guys didn't think about it. 
Can you give me a um a mm. hot dog bun? Hopefully you guys in the comments got it. Derry, can you give me a hot dog bun? Mm. Oh. Oh, you gonna use it? I won't. Uh, thank you. Mm. Okay, give me another um apple sage. Those are good. Mm. So you guys mm. comment down below if you got the answer right for my riddle. That was a pretty hard one. I mean, I'm just saying. Like, it was kind of like a trick question. Thank yeah. You. And you guys, just in case they get the right answer, you guys should pause the video before I... Um, no, they tell me that they, pa they pause it. Mm. Sometimes they put the timestamp when they pause it. Mm. They do? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm. 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 So mm -hmm. A one. Mm -hmm. Woo! That's a good job. Mm -hmm. We're gonna um, mm -hmm. we're gonna have our greens and our mac and cheese uh, recipe mm -hmm. linked uh, to this video somewhere in this video. Shanita, I'll mm -hmm. show y'all how to make this potato salad. Smack it. Mm. Mm -hmm. Do y'all like potato salad? I'm not a huge fan of it. I make it for my family. I don't mind it, but I'm not a big fan of potato salad. Did we bring an extra spoon or something to get some get up in those beans? Mm -mm. No, we didn't. Hold on, you guys. Go. All right, you guys. So I had to go over and get that spoon because your boy needs some more of these good old beans. They fire. Mm -hmm. <coughs> mm. taste this. Hey, I don't eat things like that. Got... Whoa. Take mm, it easy, Ronald. Exactly <laughs> Do we tell them what kind of sausage is this? The burgers we have are the be um, Beyond Meat burgers, and the sausages that we have are the filled roast. I have the filled roast apple yeah, stage, and we also have the filled oh, roast no. um, chipotle. Is it chipotle? What? The filled roast, the spicy one. This is a Mexican, yeah, Mexican chipotle. Mexican chipotle. There you go. Those are my favorite vegan sausages. Mm. There's more still roast. I'm not one of those. Mm-hmm. Mm. You have the fill roast. The spicy ones fill roast. Oh yeah. Not the spicy one, that one. They both fill roast, just apple sage. <laughs> Two different flavors. <laughs> apple sage. Mm -hmm. You said you had both. This is hot. I took one bite. I knew it. I told you. I um, told you. I'm still mm. eating it though. I already crunched that whole time. I'm a savage no, up in what here. Ooh, yeah. You guys, I kind of want to address something too today. I want to say something about like, like vegan. Like, <clears throat> there's some harsh vegans out, out there that's really strict and all that. I just feel like they should ease ease up. Like, if certain people like that Carl Jr. Y'all were saying, oh, it's cooked on the same conveyor belt and blase, blase. Like, man, give people a chance. Like, you mm -hmm. don't, do you not want them to go vegan because they was eating on a freaking same, same thing a meat uh, or a beef burger was on? Like, ease it's up like on that. It's like steps to this. And it's like, yeah, they, this ain't, we don't even live in a vegan world. Like, yeah. So come on, you guys. A lot of things like y'all be tripping on a gang of stuff. Like yeah, we're not talking about um, you guys, our supporters. We're talking about even on Instagram. Um, that goes for for me. Goes for whoever. Yeah, we're talking about like people just like just mm. going crazy. That like just that's not vegan. It's um, it's cooked on the same thing, or that's not whatever. Or even products that say may contain or whatever. Like, I just feel like if you're for the cause or for a certain cause and you're pushing people away when they're taking one step forward trying to do something, you're only hurting whatever you're trying to um, do. If you want people to be vegan or whatever you want them to do, you can't bully nobody into doing anything or doing it exactly how you want them to do. Everything is a work in progress. Mm. 
But uh, seriously, so I just know it's some really harsh people, vegans, not vegans, whatever. But right now we're talking about vegans. There's some really harsh vegans that will like criticize you for anything, any mistake you make. And it's like, wow. And if you're not strong enough, some people will be like, well, why should I even do this then? Why should I even continue if yeah. I'm just going to get bad? And especially like, damn. I be hate when, don't y'all hate when y'all about to say something and you just forget. But I think I'm <laughs> <laughs> right. The food's so good. You can... Dang. Let me take a, let me get a bite of cornbread and thing. No, but <laughs> <laughs> no, you guys. We our channel is all about positive vibes. We try to keep positive energy, bring you guys fun recipes, and you know just do our part show you guys it's a judge free zone we don't judge anybody of whatever they're doing nobody has the right i don't feel to judge anybody so well yeah, that's what i'm gonna say <laughs> i knew once i started it took that cornbread i get that sugar up in me <laughs> but yeah um it's like again <laughs> <laughs> i'm done Again? Again? Forgot that? <laughs> nah, let me get this again, bro. Yeah. I'm just saying, like, oh my god. When you, especially if you was born into something, like, if you was born into eating meat, you was never taught of this type of thing. Just mm -hmm. like, it's kind of hard to let go of something that you was taught your whole life to eat yeah. this, this, and that. Milk is strong for your bones, and <laughs> had all right? the, the commercials and all that, like. Yeah. So if people are giving it a chance or going in the right direction why bash them for that have you That's ever heard your teacher say if you don't got nothing good to say don't say it <laughs> no your seriously teacher told you that. i think we told you that right no my teacher told me that too mm -hmm. huh. they're great yeah no it's, it's true i mean everybody's entitled to their own opinions definitely respect everybody having their own opinions but when you're trying to bash somebody mm. for making some type of Step forward. That's I just I don't feel like that's right. But yeah, that's pretty much. Oh, and I had a question. Um, if, if anybody's vegan, um, and or eats a plant based diet, and or even vegetarian, and you're pregnant, or if you were pregnant, did you guys crave like animal products or meat or anything like that? Because I had a friend that said um, her friend was pregnant. She was vegan, I believe, or vegetarian. One of them. And when she got pregnant, like, she had to eat meat because she was craving it so heavy. Like, she she had to. Yeah, that's what she said. Um, oh, I she wasn't. Vegan meat. I've never been pregnant. So, I wonder what was her point of going vegan. No, I don't know about that. I'm just saying. I guess, well... I didn't talk to the person that was pregnant. This is coming from my friend who said her friend. It's not like he said that she said. Yeah. <laughs> no, but yeah. Um, I'm just I'm mm. just asking out of curiosity because um, unfortunately when I was pregnant, I wasn't vegan at the time. Um, but I'm just curious. Do you if you guys are pregnant out there or have you been pregnant vegan or vegetarian? Did you guys crave like meat and stuff or was it like a heavy craving? I'm just curious. There'll be a whole nother conversation, you guys. Alright. It's late, too. Look at this guy. He ready to go to sleep. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm just, I'm just listening to what you guys saying. Mm-hmm. That was a squeaky right there. Well. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. I'm stuck. Me, too. Oh, bomb. Oh, it's so good, you guys. You guys stuffed? Mm -hmm. I told us he couldn't even finish Ooh. my Wow. Well, but yeah, you guys. Mm. For reals, you guys are vegan that's harsh out there and you're trying to pull people in. You can't go ham on them. Yeah. You gotta give people a chance. You, I feel like leading by example, showing people the way by just you living your life. You can't yeah, you can't bully nobody into nothing. You can't make nobody do nothing that they don't want to do. And if people are, like Babe said, if you already grew up your whole life, it's hard to change your ways. 
when you were taught something, you have to like unlearn and relearn things. So if people are making some type of <clears throat> effort, don't judge them. And that's with anything in life, not just vegan. That's with anything. If somebody is making an effort to change their way, their ways, whether it's very tiny or a large progress, don't judge them. As long as they're making some type of progress, I feel like that's all that matters. But yeah, you guys. Ooh. Cool. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Hope you guys yes. enjoyed the information that we was talking about. The tips are, you know. <laughs> yeah, just getting a little little something off our chest, you guys. But, um, oh yeah, shout out to all our new subbies. Uh, we've been getting some new subbies lately. And we wanted to shout out you guys. Thank you guys. For joining the Liddy Gang family. We, we really appreciate you guys. We're almost at 4K, Liddy Gang. Yes, you guys. Almost, almost at 4K. Y'all, we, we appreciate you. Keep sharing our up. videos. Keep telling people about us. Let us know. You know, word of mouth. Just get us around. Like you guys been doing. Tagging us on Instagram when you guys make our recipes. Oh my God, I love seeing when you guys make our recipes. So. Let us know if you guys tried that Parmesan garlic. Are you going to try it? Yes. Perfect time for the Super Bowl. So, if yeah. you guys do make it, tag us on IG. Mm -hmm. Let us know. Let us know what you guys think, how you like it, and yep. Yeah, you guys, we about to sign out, though, because I'm stuffed and I'm tired. I didn't caught the eye this, y'all. And we got to get these BAKs to bed. <laughs> yeah, we got to get them to bed. They got school in the morning. But, you guys, if you haven't what? Thumbs up this video. Big fat. <laughs> if you haven't already. Y'all, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. That big red sign that says subscribe. It's free. Hit it for us, you guys. Um, ooh. <laughs> I feel like I was about to burp. Hit the subscribe button. Leave us a comment down below on anything that you guys feel in. And again, we love, love, love you guys and appreciate you guys so yes, much. Yes, sir. But we've been... Bye. <laughs> I feel like our words have been tucked out. We're about to get out of here, y'all. Peace.